Hello guys, what I've done here this evening, let me get the uh, volume right, um, I've basically constructed a little um, gas nozzle extrusion device, I guess you could call it that. I've had this quite for quite a while, this little setup, and it's just basically a bit of plastic acrylic tubing or wire sleeving with a brass connector that fits on the end of this gas bottle for bubbling butane through solutions. But now what I've done is I've basically made a head to it so I can heat with it. Um, it's using a um, a milled um, brass head and that's good at dissipating the heat. Now what I've done here is I've put, where did I put the rubber grommets? I put a rubber grommet on the end of the gas bottle itself. I don't know if you'll be able to see that properly. But I've basically constructed free washer stack with a rubber grommet on the top and then with this brass threaded piece I basically just hook that over the top and then it makes perfect contact when pushed down making it airtight to come through the acrylic tubing straight out the end of the gas nozzle which is kind of a nice little um, minimalist invention it's just for quick heating it does produce quite a flame now I tried this in the garden as an experiment just now and it worked very well so I'm kind of happy about that so yeah guys it's all there I super glued it which seems a bit chavvy but I thought because it's brass it's good at dissipating heat but I wouldn't use this for long periods of times to say the least but for now it's alright so what I've done is I took this threaded nut and I put a smaller insert of brass inside with a flat head piece on there and then what that allowed me to do is basically um, make a, an out extruded piece out the end so I could put this acrylic tubing nicely around and get a nice contact with it get nice contact with it now the brass head I might even mill out a bit more of this uh, threaded nut insert and um, basically put a threaded well a thread into there and tie it, fasten it down so either side so it holds in the um, gas nozzle that would make it a lot more reliable and it wouldn't drop off that. It feels fairly loose but you know it's quite good because it's manually um, sort of you see it's manually adjustable and because it's got that nice little washer stack it, it doesn't let, it let you push down too far and the rubber grommet obviously helps give quicker air contact which makes it a lot better really I mean I thought of that afterwards because I needed something that was removable to replace the bottle obviously um, but I didn't want to make anything permanent because this bottle is disposable it's not refillable so maybe in the future I'll work on a refillable tank for this uh, and it would be pretty cool if I could do that because then I could have like a refillable Bunsen burner I guess which would be pretty goddamn badass if I'm going to say at least I'm thinking of putting a regulation sort of set up onto this so I can regulate how much gas goes into the setup um, via an inline pipe regulation kit which I have already got the foul for that so yeah that's been my little experiment for here tonight thanks for watching